dressed and ready to go to see, what are we going to see this morning? A fire truck. A fire truck. I put Lyndall in red. She agreed that red would be a great choice. And Bear, what's on your shirt, buddy? Cars. Cars, let me see. There's a car on the back too. What kind of cars are on there, buddy? Car on the back. There is a car on the back. What's this one? Right here. What is that? Top. Yeah. What Come about, there's one. What about this one, Bear? What kind of, what kind of truck is this? Fire truck. Fire truck. On our way, we're getting right his there, haircut. Right there, right there. <laughs> Killing two birds with one stone, if you will. And that means I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna work on his hair right now because it's just gonna get trimmed. Are you excited for a haircut? You know what we should probably do is put on a different shirt for getting your hair cut. That would be smart. My mom is gonna come up and stay with baby Eloise. I imagine we'll only be gone for maybe an hour. You're all done? Okay, right, do you wanna go see a fire truck too? Did you guys eat some breakfast? Good. I'm so excited, this is gonna be so fun. Brad put on Blippi, the fire truck episode. Uh, he, in an attempt to like make my morning go more smoothly, he put the TV on. It does work. I don't like using the TV to like enhance moods because I feel like that's cheating, I guess. I don't know, but it really does work. Like, it just made a big difference in our morning. Bear grew out of some of my favorite shoes for him. They're so cute, and I was bummed because I got them on his, I got him on his foot, but he was not comfortable in them. So I think what I will do is put these in our Poshmark closet. So if you think that these are cute, they're size seven. He didn't wear them very many times. They're in great condition, and they were just like church shoes, so he didn't do a whole lot of like playing outside in them. So those will be in our Poshmark closet if you're interested in that. What's that? Do you remember the buzzers last time? To cut your hair on the sides, it buzzes. Like this? Do you remember? Yeah? <laughs> Sounds like a bee. We'll do that, it's much faster. Good job. Noxie's only had two hair, well, yeah, two haircuts. Oh, really? And he's two, but he turned two in last August. Oh, okay. A doggy right there. Okay, let's go this way, guys. Let's go this way. We gotta go let him know we're here. What do you think, Bear? Good haircut, buddy. Yeah, he did so Looking good. pretty sharp. Yeah. <laughs> you wanna come see some fire trucks? Yeah. All right, yeah. let's go. All right, this All right. is his twin sister. Hi. She's gonna tag along if that's okay. okay. That's fine. All right. Yeah, what up? How's it going? How we doing? Wow. Let's go this way, Bear. Turn this way. Let's go this way. Good morning. Did you just get a haircut? Yeah. You look pretty dapper, buddy. <laughs> I like that sweatshirt. What's on it, Bear? Is it a sweater? A sweater. It's Is there fire trucks on there? Yeah. And police cars? <laughs> oh, and a paddy wagon, it looks like. Yep, pretty awesome. <laughs> This is so cool. You guys are awfully dressed up to come to the fire station. <laughs> we take this seriously. Mama's got you guys dressed up nice. <laughs> Firefighter here out here hanging out in the base. So we're gonna oh, say hi to him. Wow. You wanna say hi to the firefighters? Come this way. What do you think? Come this way. Let's go say hi to them. Let's go see what these firefighters are doing. Hello. Hello. This is Bear. And this is Lindell. Lindell. Can you say hi, guys? Hello. How are you doing? How you doing? Wow. What is that, Bear? They want to see the fire truck. Oh, sorry. See the lights? All right, let's go up here to the driver's seat. Put you up in the driver's seat. Oh, my gosh, they are. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, pretty close in age. <laughs> Built-in best friends. Yeah. Is that a fire truck? Oh my gosh. Hey Bear, would you like to sit up in this one? Yeah. All right, come here. Wow. Not too busy this morning? No, not That's too good. good. Come here, let me pick you up. 
One, two, three. Oh. All right, let's put you like that. All right, mom, want to get a picture of you? Yes, right we there. got it. Can you smile? Give me a big smile. Where's your teeth? Can you show me your teeth? He's taking this. <laughs> taking this job very seriously. Can you smile? There's a good one. We got it. Wow, bear. You want to turn the lights on? All right. Come up here. Can you push that red button for me? Let's push this red button. Whoa. Come here. I'll show Come you. look. Look what you did. Look what you did. You see all the lights on? Look at all up there. Wow. I think we got to let Sissy sit up there. Yeah, let's go, Lindell. Keep going, follow him. Fire truck. Fire truck, that's come right. Here. Bear, come here. Come here, right here. Cat and Priest got a hose for you. That's the hose. You want to hold it? Uh oh, what's he doing? It's a little <laughs> stuck. Yeah. Hold on, they got to use their big muscles to get it out. Wanna hold that? Oh, yeah. Whoa, is it heavy? It's a really big garden hose. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> you drink out of it? <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, Bear. Cool. Wow. Look at all that hose See coming out. Stuff up here? here, Bear. Whoa. You want to hold one of those, Lindell? Yeah? Lightsabers. Look at that. <laughs> is that, that what? Is cool stuff right there. Is that the technical term, lightsaber? Yeah, they're <laughs> lights for our roadway. Oh, okay. He's going to put those pants on and a boot, and he's got a hood. He's going to put over his, over his face to protect his face and ears so he doesn't get burned, okay? So he's gonna look a little different, but that's far, still firefighter eight, you know? And he's gonna put on a big coat, and he's got a helmet, oh, right. and that gear protects him so in a fire, so the fire doesn't... Okay. They're making some noise back there, aren't they? You guys are noisy. Firefighters are noisy. We are. What you do? Is fire pretty hot, Bear? Yeah, it's hot. It'll burn you, right? Yeah. Look at all that gear he has. In full gear and air pack on the tools we carry, he's had 75 pounds to his. Holy uh, cow, that 75 pounds, Bear. Yeah, that doesn't include if we pick up hose and other stuff, we could be well between 125 and 150. Wow, so, uh, is that pretty cool? He's probably weighs about, what, 250? Uh, yeah, 235. 235, so he's pushing close to 400 pounds. Oh my gosh, Yeah. pretty warm in there? It is. Yeah, do they have like built-in air conditioning? No. No. They have two layers. This outer shell protects us from the flame. Okay. It okay. will burn protects from the flame. Then the inner layer helps absorb some of our moisture and wick it away from our body so we don't steam burn. Think Interesting. Think like having your hand wet, stick it in the oven, you'll steam burn. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I never even thought about so, that. Wow. So you could literally walk through fire in that. I mean, you have to. For a few seconds. Okay. It not it, not much. How hot the fire is. Okay. It'll discolor. Too. Yeah. 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 Am I still? Yeah. Am I scary now? And you see, like here, and they're like, no. But you put a mask on, you see all their faces like. Yeah. I'm like, hey, it's still me in here. Yeah. I'm scared. And they're like, okay. Yeah. And then I let people. I get all geared up and let let them just come up and like. Let yeah. Them touch, but they're like. <laughs> and I, of course, you have some that are like. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh yeah. All about it. So. Hey. Bear, what is this? What do you think that is? You know what that is? Is that a flashlight? Do you see it? Look back on the wall over there. See over there? Look back Whoa. there. Look on the truck. See so the I can light? make it off the wall. That's a flashlight so he can see. Friday morning. Okay. And then it'll go off Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and it'll come back Tuesday, Wednesday. Wow. 48 hours of work. And yeah. It was a hard adjustment when we went to it 10 years ago because I've been on the standard 24 on 24 off. You work that way for your third day and then you go off for four days. So it was a big adjustment. But I
thing is probably the best shift I've ever worked. Oh, really? Yeah. Is I'm it here for two days and then you're off before. So if I took off this rotation, I'd have 10 days off. Oh, okay. That's a vacation. Sure, you know, yeah. Where you have to take off 10 days, I have to take off two. True, yeah. yeah. So we only work 10 point. days a month. Okay. That's what we normally work. So, okay, hey, this is where the guys sit. This is pretty. What do you think they do? They watch TV, they play Xbox. Oh my gosh. They see movies. That's awesome. Yeah. That's a nice kitchen. And we've got a big old kitchen over here. We we they come in and they cook breakfast every morning. Yeah, it they smells like breakfast for everybody. Smells like bacon, huh? The see, guys usually do lunch on their own and then they get together every night and eat dinner. That's cool. So. Yeah. yeah. There's a that's our car. That's your car out there, yeah. See it? That's mommy's car. Sleep. Three three captains, all three captains sleep in here. We have one bed and we have three lockers. We have a TV. They got one of the captains brought in a little fireplace. We have a little ambiance in here. We can sit at nighttime and watch TV. And then we have our own bathroom. Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? Just like at home. That's neat. Yeah. Come on this way and I'll show you some more. Come let's, here. Let's go. It's the captain's bedroom. So then we have, they have a workstation where they can do homework, they can do the reports, and a printer, and then they have more, we just have more bedrooms here. These are all bedrooms down through here. So everyone has their own room? Yeah. No sharing? Yeah. And then they have a Murphy bathroom. Okay. Mm -hmm. yep. Cool. Very cool. Come this way. Then. We need to clean our clothes from time to time because we get pretty dirty. So this is where we clean our clothes at. Just like what you do at home. But it's just for the clothes we wear. Like what we're wearing right now. Our bunker gear that we just saw, that gets washed downstairs in a separate washing machine, a special washing machine just for it. Cool. Come this way. There's just some more rooms. More bedrooms. Yep. And then we're back. And we're back. A big circle kitchen. Yeah. How about that? <laughs> we're just rounding out our fun morning with donuts. They're hilarious, aren't they? They are. Mm-hmm. Yes, you are. Thanks for hanging is out with us. Good bear? Yeah. Yep. He goes, is Yep, it is. Yes. <laughs> yes, it is. It is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yep, it is. <laughs> So mom hung out with Eloise while we went to the fire station and Eloise was good. Yes, perfect. Yeah, it lined up perfectly with her perfect first nap, so. Baby. We're eating some donuts. Man, Bear, you pounded those donuts. <laughs> Do you like the chocolate one or the cinnamon one better? Oh, cinnamon one, oh my goodness. <laughs> that looks so yummy. <laughs> Would you like some more, please? He's that's perfect. Your hands on your shirt. He's using sign language to say please, and that's like a perfect way to. Ah! <gasps> Chocolate. Eat it off your finger. Daddy's home. I really, I don't know why we buy toys. I mean, look how much fun they're having with just. Although toilet paper is harder, much harder to come by these days than toys. It's a hot commodity. Whoa. Good thing the crowd Bear, watch, watch your head, buddy. Watch your head. Jeepers, creepers, sakes alive. So, horrible story. Uh, is that a dead bug or a live bug? Live bug. I don't think so. I think it's dead. Anyway, back to me. So I had to go to Walmart on my lunch break to get these shout wiping goes because I got chocolate espresso beans. I mean, this is like... I spent like a half an hour trying to get the stains out, but this was like pure chocolate all up in here, up in here. <laughs> so on my way home from the reserves this past weekend, I stopped at a gas station, got some uh, dark chocolate. Chocolate was made in-house at this like uh, truck stop. Anyway, that's and so I had chocolate espresso beans in my car and they had melted and I didn't realize it. So I was like eating a couple. I had chocolate all over my hand. I was like wiping it on my leg, and, like not knowing that I had chocolate. So embarrassing. I'm sure there's a, 
There's probably a couple of really funny stories with people that like at their lunch break at work got it all over their clothes. So drop a comment below if that's happened to you. And not a big fan of those. The tight stick doesn't really work. Those shout and go don't really work. So if you have something that's good for spot cleaning at work, let us know.